Hey guys, first of all, thanks for your support on the video I uploaded yesterday. I said I will release my uh, glow settings and also this nice preset for glowing text. Um, you will need After Effects CS5 for this, I think, and also the plugin uh, Star Glow for the glowing text and the plugin 3D Stroke for the um, yeah preset I made for you. It's basically this little transition, but you can just uh, copy my glow settings if you don't have 3D stroke and want to want the glow settings for like something else, then you can just copy that. So, if you want to know how to install it, uh, first of all, just go uh, go to the link in the description and just um, it just download it, and then you can check out the tutorial link on the screen right now to see how you can install it. So, it's pretty easy to do. Um, so for this transition, uh, basically, if you have two clips, I want the transition to be right there. You just add a new uh, solid, and then you just drag that effect onto that and press U for the keyframes and then you drag it so that uh, the middle keyframe is right where you, the, you want the transition to be. So, um, but you can also, if you have like any other um, uh, like 3D strokes and you want these glow settings because without that it looks pretty bad so then you can just go there and copy that. So, looks pretty nice right here. So. You can just go there and play around with all the settings like colors and stuff. Um, you can do lots of stuff with this. And also um, for the glowing text, you just um, you, you just have to use the text. It doesn't matter which color the text is because actually you do the color with this ramp. So if you want to change that color, you can just go there and change those colors. Or you could go to Star Glow and like change the preset so that it looks like different, I know. Um, so yeah, it looks pretty nice. You can also go there and change these values, but it's all personal preference. So um, I hope you like this, and if you have any tutorial requests, then just write them in the comments, and it would be awesome if you could rate the video and also check out the other tutorial I uploaded yesterday if you haven't already. So yeah, that's basically it. Bye.